Do you think that uh, sometimes when people are dealing with depression, they should just maybe cheer up a bit? It only could be like this. Yo, you're depressed. Boom, you're all good. My buddy was at a party with us, and he was sort of like grumpy the whole time. Seemed a little selfish. We had honey dips there. It was like a whole thing, right? Maybe he needs therapy and medication. But also potentially just cheer up. Do you think depressed people should just cheer up a bit? I don't have the authority for that. Well, one of our bodies is uh, depressed and he's been grumping around and everything and we've been trying to tell him to cheer up and he's been like, oh, I can't. That sucks for him. And I Sort of sucks more for us though, if you really think about it. Well, no. Well, because we're the ones that had our party ruined. You didn't have to invite him. To be honest, we kind of forgot he was in the group chat or I probably wouldn't have invited him. Maybe he's in a bad mood around you guys because you're not very nice to him. Well, maybe we're not very nice to him because he's grumpy, so it's sort of a chicken and egg situation, right? Well, I mean, if you don't want him around, you don't have to invite him around. Yeah, I know. We had the whole group chat mishap. But do you think that's probably the move for people that are, like, you know, claiming to be depressed or whatever? Just don't invite them anywhere sort of thing? Problem solved? No. Maybe hang out with him when you're in the mood to, like, sort of schlub around and eat potato chips. But well, I mean, you don't have to schlub around and eat potato chips. You could... Uh, you do with this guy. I promise you that. I don't think you really like being this guy's friend that much. But lately, it does feel like that. I'm sort of questioning whether it's even worth it. Yeah, but, like, why do you think he's upset? He's a baby, maybe? I don't know. Sorry. Are we filming this? We had a bunch of honey dips there, and we had one girl that was actually pretty fit that actually kind of had a thing for him before she saw him ruining it. A good friend would see if they could help. You don't think a, a fit honey would be, like, pretty good for anyone who's depressed? You don't know what a fit honey is? A hot chick? A what? You've never seen that? A hot chick? Oh, yeah, but I... Oh, you've seen mostly sixes, or...? No, I'm just, I don't understand, I didn't know the reference. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, like, you know what I mean, like a dime piece. And and she was pretty into him, too. You don't think that would help if you're depressed a little bit? Everybody should be depressed a little bit. In this day and age, if you're not mad or you're not angry, then you're crazy. There's so little control in each person's hands. You kind of sound like him a little bit. This is the kind of stuff he was saying at the party. Alcohol is not a therapy. If anything, it's going to work against you. Do you think we should do like non-alcoholic funnels or something like that so we can participate? That kind of stuff at all. That doesn't sound to me at helpful at all. Getting him drunk or late is going to help. I was in a bad mood once and my buddies hooked me up with a threesome and I was like pumped for breakfast. You can understand a guy with a brain tumor because you had a headache once. Well, he doesn't have a brain tumor, but we try to get him brains. Uh. I'd, I'd really be interested in understanding what this this is about, he's just struggling. He's out of control. That is perfectly said. But tell me, what's this all about?